Hi guys and welcome to this Doom 2015 HD and Brutal Doom 2.0 tutorial. In case you might have missed it, the version 2.0 of Brutal Doom has been released last month. It is such an awesome mod, so I decided to create a video tutorial for you to show how you can install Doom with the HD mod and this Brutal Doom 2. The good thing is that this HD pack along with Brutal Doom 2 works with your Doom, Doom 2 and the expansion packs. Like what you are seeing? Then let's start with the tutorial. Alright, let's get started. Let's go to prickcaliber.com and I would also like to mention that I've got a new forum and on this forum you are able to ask anything and everything advanced if you have a problem or you just want to discuss some stuff. You're welcome to visit the forum. Anyway, let's go back to the site, go to game tutorials, click on Doom. And on here you are able to download the Precalibur.com Doom Pack. So let's download it. And I did host it on my Dropbox. So let's download it. I'm just gonna save it on my desktop. Doesn't really matter where you save it. Okay, let's wait a little bit. Wait a little bit until it has finished. Once the pack finished downloading, you can extract the pack. And I would like to point out that for this tutorial, of course, you are going to need Doom, the games or the game itself. And the HD pack and Brutal Doom works for Doom 1, Doom 2, and its expansions, which are Plutonia and TNT. And if you bought Doom or um, downloaded it, it should be uh, what files. So if you bought the game on Steam or on Google Games or you just downloaded it from the internet, you should have it in what files. So the entire game, Doom 1, is this what file, Doom 2 is this what file, and the expansions are here, there, also in what files. So make sure you get them also. Then once you have extracted the pack, open it up and here you can see these four RAR files this first one brutal is brutal doom itself the second one is GZ doom it's an advanced um, launcher for doom or the doom games ZDL is a program that we are going to use um, for launching doom games together with brutal doom and ZDoom. doom um, uh, sorry the texture pack which is named ZDoom. doom but this is the texture pack. We're going to extract them all. So extract Brutal Doom, extract GZ Doom, extract ZDL, and extract the texture pack Z Doom. Then you can open up ZDL, the folder. From there, copy all the files or cut them. It doesn't really really matter because we are going to use ZDL together with GZ Doom. So paste them. Uh, paste the files right in there then what you want to do is um, let's see uh, brutal doom um, also copy or cut the pk3 file and paste that in your uh, gz doom folder and also the texture pack is a pk3 file and you can also paste that in your um, gz doom folder and that means you actually only now need the GZ Doom folder because we extracted everything else in our GZ Doom folder. All right. All right. Then the most important step is to actually add the Doom games also to the folder. So open up uh, the folder, the what files. There, copy or cut the what files and also paste them in your GZ Doom folder. That's really important, else there are no Doom games to launch. Then you can open up ZDL.exe, then click on settings, and on here we are going to add Doom games to our ZDL. You can do that by clicking on add, and then click on browse, and first we're going to add Doom 1, click on OK, then add Doom 2 if you have that. Click on OK, you can put up a custom name, but it does not really matter. And then we also have Plutonia, the expansion pack, and we also have TNT. Okay. 
and what we want to do here is our source ports engine so where doom is going to be launched with is of course gz doom so we're going to add that click on ok all right then you can go to main and on external files that is where we are going to launch a brutal doom and the texture pack so click on add and let's see let's um let's add brutal and let's add set doom the texture pack okay and then we can let's see click on launch oh yeah you have to of course select the game which you want to launch so either launch doom 1 launch doom 2 launch plethonia or launch tnt together with these two mods this will mean that the external files will also be launched with either doom 1 doom 2 plethonia or tnt so let's launch um, an example doom 2 with this brutal doom and with the ag texture pack and i will show you how to configure everything in game all right on startup go to your options and then go to set video mode where you can change your resolution and on the display options there are a lot of things that you can change and adjust you can also change your anisotrophic filtering as you can see it normally stands in 8 but you can increase it to 16 and there are just a lot of things that you can experiment with also don't forget to change your controls your key mappings because if you play it like this you will have to use arrow keys to move around which is something you did 20 years ago you also want to check free look this allows you to look around freely then you can just start the game and enjoy brutal doom 2.0 together with an AG texture pack and with that we reach the end of this tutorial thank you very much for watching if you could do me a favor please register on my new forum it is also way easier to ask your questions there or just discuss fun things thanks and see you in the next tutorial